Hello and welcome to another adventure on this planet Earth. I'm Mark Gilchrist and this week we're going to Northern Thailand and we're going to barge into a noodle factory. Yep, that's an old car. That's a stage. And that's going to be a bonfire around New Year's Eve. Uh, coming in the middle of April here. Well, there I was riding along, minding my own business, and I found a noodle factory. <laughs> it's one of my favorite things to stumble across the manufacturing process and work my way in there, kind of barge in. Sawadee Hello, Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. I think that's the owner. It's a neat little process. They must make several hundred pounds of noodles every day. This is my friend. Hey, hi there. Yes, he seems to be manager of the joint. This is where it all starts. You got bags of flour and, uh, and buckets of broken eggs. And once those get mixed up in these tubs, then they get thoroughly stirred in this machine that just grinds it to a paste almost. Uh, or I guess a powder. And then it goes over to this machine, which takes the, the powder and forms it into sheets. Puts it on rolls like paper towels. This machine makes paper towels out of flour and egg. There we go. Big yellow paper towels. Then they take the paper towels over to this machine, and which uh, slices them up into, into noodle sized noodle stuff. All that gets taken over to a rack, and those go out into the sun to dry. I don't know what they do during monsoon season when it rains every, every day. Well, that is the morning routine. They let the noodles dry in the sun for several hours, and at about 2 p.m., they start pulling them off the racks. Workers bring the noodles inside and load them into this trough with, with string placed about every eight inches or so. Then they take this scary looking knife and cut it all into sections. So now they have several huge bundles of noodles all ready for packaging. These are loaded one kilogram at a time into bags that are tied shut with rubber bands. And they're ready to send off to the stores and restaurants. So what's the difference between pasta and noodles? <laughs> Well, I see. I like to say if uh, if it's for Italian food, it's pasta. If it's if it's for Asian, it's noodles. I've heard all sorts of explanations, um, like as to what kind of wheat is used, or I've heard that the texture when it's cooked al dente. The big difference I've noticed is the ability to hold on to a sauce. Pasta seems to hold sauce as well, and noodles. Stuff slides right off, and noodles are often used in soup, so there. Yeah, beautiful day in Misai, Thailand at a noodle factory. Well, thanks for hanging for another adventure. I'm Mark Gilchrist, and I am, and you are, we all are, on this planet Earth.